Hi there, welcome to my channel. Today what we're going to be doing is uh, some uh, note taking. I've created these uh, pages so that I can do uh, some notes on motivational studies. I just thought it would be interesting to just do these uh, uh, notes. And it's just basically a short video, a, a continuation of these pages. Uh, they're very simple pages. I've just used some photos and a little bit of color. And I've just wanted to make the pages a little bit more interesting so that I, it would be something that I would want to look at. So I'm just going to do these pages and uh, we're going to see what this uh, actually looks like. Uh, what I'll be using is a vintage typewriter and basically this is how it works. Um, it's something that I use now uh, quite a bit. I didn't think I would actually use it but I actually like it a lot and uh, it's very it's it's not the greatest typewriter but it's convenient and I like how neat uh, the pages look. So I'll be using this and then I will be completing the pages uh, using the vintage typewriter. Uh, basically what I've done here is finished the notes that I wanted to do. Um, I've left the, the, uh, the middle pages blank, but then I actually did uh, extra pages and I've done extra pages on the motivation I want to do. So what I'm going to do now is with these two pages, I'm just going to put in very important things that I need to look at as part of the motivational uh, section. And I'm just going to finish that and then I will talk about how these pages work. Well, I finished these notes. Uh, this is on uh, notes on how to be more motivated. And uh, these notes are just generally to uh, just, you know, kind of advice. And um, basically this is on the other side of it. So I've great basically got some notes together just to to help me uh, to see if I can make a, any difference in how I do my planning or how I do my projects. And then what I did in the center, I just kind of made uh, some notes uh, of, of my own kind of thing based on the motivational things, things that I need to look at. Uh, one of them was my goals and the other thing was uh, setting boundaries um, and also having a specific plan. Uh, and then, you know, to get motivated uh, uh, for the reasons why you want to, to do your projects, you know, get the motivation out of there. Also, it also mentions about motivation is can it be fun? Some of these projects that I do are not so much fun. They're quite boring to do. But when I do the projects, they actually come out really well and they look really great. And so I've got to try and find a way to uh, be motivated for the final outcome of some of these projects that I do. So what I've done is I've put these notes together. Um, I'm probably going to reuse these notes uh, or I could actually put the take, transfer these notes uh, into next year as well. So some of these notes um, have longevity because you can uh, use them again and you just transfer them and sometimes just making them quite simple is really easier uh, to do. Uh, what I do, do is every time I do notes like this, I put them at the end of the month, usually. I put them at the end of the month. And uh, this is just a continuation of where it is. So when I do the next month, um, this will be, uh, this will be for the month of... Um, July that I've done and then basically what happens is this will be at the end of the month and then when I start the next month I will start it over here and put the, the pages onto this section. So whether you're doing notes or whether you're doing a little bit of self-study it's always good to sometimes make notes that look a little bit more interesting so that you can look at them again and, uh, you know, it's just a case of just making them quite simple. Um, this is a, a, a type of way of um, doing notes for other things as well. So if you wanted to do a timetable, that would this would work as well. Uh, if you have to collect um, 
if you're doing a project and you need to collect a whole lot of stuff, uh, this can be a list for that as well. And also what you want to accomplish with the pro uh, with the, the project that you want to do. So these are, are really sometimes very useful to what you can do. Anyway, this is just a short video. I wanted to make something uh, easy to watch. And uh, just to show you uh, how to do some of these uh, notes. So I want to say thank you for watching. Uh, please subscribe and leave a comment. And I will get back to you on the next project I'm going to do. So I will see you then.